Alright guys, um, I'm here. Yes, I didn't go like this morning. I was it in a mood. Um, an update on the catch up I done. It first book it was uh dead. So I read that chapter in that book, but I've been looking at the ch chapters. It's like like talking about each person and their day and who they are. And I said, no, no, not for me. So I see it a bit. So I watched what first in first chapter and couple chapter in second chapter. So I said, no, no. Even I was tired. I got. I said, this is not for me. So, I went to the next mm, pump. It was meant I picked burgers and ducks. Ducks. And I got the dress maker's secret. Actually, this is pretty good. And I got up to chapter five, no, six, five, six, four, sorry, chapter four. And they're pretty going fast in this. Out of the 32 chapters in here, and I'm, if I can't keep waiting in a couple of days, I will finish it in a couple of days. And go on to the next meal if I keep at it. Yeah, it's day seven in the catch up a -thon, so. Seven more days, so I am I'm done. But I got the book set up for the rest of the year, so I can't wait. If I couldn't finish the catch up the thought with the books I picked up, it's going to be, be part of the end of your watch it. Anyways, um, in this book, it is, first two chapters was the granddaughter of Adela, Adela, yeah, and Chloe is her name, but she went to Paris for an option because the main story is the it was set in World War Two and and the Germans were the Nazis were in Beit Paris France I think 1940s and yeah and the two other characters were Adel Adeline and Coco Chanel if you don't know Coco Chanel she is the famous perfume Per 
famous perfume out there. Like Shed Shed Nine and a couple other perfumes out there. And at the time it was in the war, they were staying at the late five star spans of hotels in Paris at that time. But come on to current times where Chloe, Chloe went to Paris to an auction and got she bid a couple items that she thinks her grandmother really liked. And remember Paris, especially the Ritz Hotel. And after when they did the first round of auction, Chloe realized there was a young guy, handsome guy, watching her. So Chloe went up and entered to talk to him, and he went. Well, I think it's when Benz Benz's Think Benz's and what Benz was No, no and Tina E T I E N N E in tin something like that. And we realized he was related to guess related to Chanel Coco Chanel or something like that. And uh, when they got talking and left the auction to a uh, cafe, and Chloe realized her mother was part of the, the spy, working for a spy, realized Coco was a Nancy spy. And I locked it up, made sure she was part of the Nancy's spy. So if you don't want, don't believe me, go go it and see. Yeah, she was part of the Nancy's. And And yeah, and when she realized more information, she didn't believe it at first. She wasn't as working at spy, at spy with that spy. She thought she was a maid for. Not a maid. A maid, yeah. A her secretary for a wealthy woman at that time. But 
here. It's not done here. But I got into the real story of ch chapter 3 and 4 where talk about Adeline. She said she was giant by she was young early twenties. Never be married, had never had kids. Giant fine job. But again giant play at these jobs. Like uh Miss Mistress sewing machine, dressmaking, but they say you don't have a, a experience to be this. You eat them any job. You don't have the experience to do things. So, that's why she was in with, got job with Chanel as her personal secretary. And her, that money wasn't that it was great but not that great because it was during the war so it was a job and she will started to we learn, learn she was talking to the Nazis. So and but she wasn't too sure she was a spy then. But I'm not sure when she was Learned she was a spy, but at the time she was there with her. But the place she, they were living, it was a nice place. But at that time, they realized that Nazis, Nazis were coming in to invade. And at the line, we always walking down. There were soldiers walking around the, in the area where the hotel is. So, Adeline and Chanel moved, got packed, and moved to Southern Brunson and stayed at her other house for who knows how long. And Adeline said, who knows when we stay here. It will be a couple of days, a couple of months. For a couple years, so that's my intake. Like and to me, historical fiction and and fantasies are my intake on new books. So, anyways. That's my review and my 
where I am I'm but catch up a dog. So if so see you guys later and happy week.